Hey everyone, it's Susan Arno smith and welcome to the weekly vlog about writing your novel. Today we're still on setting. Today we're talking about the long view. Last week we gave just a specific nuts and bolts about what the time piece was. But here what we're going to do is talk about something a little different. If you're doing a book that's, that covers a long specific period of time, there's some specific things you need to really be careful of and aware of. And that is that everything changes in your book through time. The physicality of the place will change. Roads will suddenly appear where there weren't any houses. Maybe whole communities will vanish where there used to be something. People, what they wear, what's expected of them, what's allowed and permitted, what, what, how they behave, what they say to each other, and what they do. All of those little pieces and details can create a sense of spaciousness in us that makes us know and believe in your world. But you have to really make us care. And the way to do that is to root all of those things, the specificities of those details in a character's actions. You can give us a whole lot in a character's emotions and actions as it applies to setting. And if you do this and it's a long book, then that book will stay with us long after that book is finished. So write. And what you need to do this time is take a look at whether or not you can tie any part of your setting to a character's specific action or specific thought, specific emotion. Give us just enough to get us started at every juncture and go with it. Talk to you soon. Write. See you next week.